Hi guys, welcome back to Mechanical Boost. Your vehicle's steering system is critical for safe and smooth operation on the road. One component that can often develop issues is the intermediate steering shaft. In this video, we are going to discuss the symptoms of a bad steering shaft. Before discussing symptoms, let's quickly discuss the function of intermediate steering shaft. The intermediate steering shaft is a part of the vehicle's steering system that connects the steering wheel to the steering rack. Its primary function is to transmit the rotational movement of the steering wheel to the steering mechanism. It allows the driver to control the direction of the vehicle. The intermediate steering shaft is located in the engine bay inside the vehicle, connected to the steering column on the driver's side. It is connected to the steering wheel by a universal joint and to the steering gear by another universal joint. Now, let's discuss the symptoms of a bad steering shaft. 1. Strange noises One of the most noticeable signs of a failing intermediate steering shaft is unusual noises when turning the steering wheel. Unusual noises like clunking, knocking, or clicking when turning the steering wheel typically indicate wear or damage in the universal joints of the intermediate steering shaft. 2. Steering wheel play Excessive play or looseness in the steering wheel may indicate a problem with the intermediate steering shaft. If you notice that the steering wheel feels loose or sloppy and there is a delay in response when turning, it could be due to wear or damage in the shaft. 3. Vibration or shimmy Vibrations or shimmying sensations in the steering wheel can occur when the intermediate steering shaft's universal joints or bearings wear out. As these components degrade, they may develop irregularities in their movement, causing the steering wheel to vibrate, especially at higher speeds. 4. Steering wheel binding In some cases, a bad intermediate steering shaft can cause the steering wheel to bind or feel stiff when turning, especially when making sharp turns or maneuvering at low speeds. This can occur if the shaft becomes misaligned, or if there is excessive friction in the joints. 5. Leaking grease If the intermediate steering shaft has grease fittings or is lubricated, leaking grease around the shaft or joints may indicate a problem. Grease leaks can occur due to damaged seals or worn components, leading to increased friction and potential failure of the shaft. 6. Visible wear or damage Inspecting the intermediate steering shaft visually can also reveal signs of wear or damage, such as visible rust, corrosion, or play in the joints. Excessive wear or movement in the shaft's components can indicate that it needs to be replaced. 7. Uneven tire wear A worn or damaged intermediate steering shaft can cause uneven tire wear, particularly on the front tires. This occurs because the shaft's compromised ability to transmit steering input accurately can lead to erratic tire movement and uneven distribution of weight on the tires during turns. 8. Difficulty steering As the intermediate steering shaft deteriorates, it may become increasingly difficult to steer the vehicle, especially at low speeds or when parking. This difficulty can be attributed to increased friction or resistance in the shaft's worn or damaged components. This makes steering effort more strenuous for the driver. If you experience any of these symptoms, it's essential to have your vehicle inspected by a qualified mechanic as soon as possible. Ignoring problems with the intermediate steering shaft can lead to further damage and compromise your safety on the road. If you found this video helpful, be sure to give it a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel for more automotive tips and tricks. As always, thanks for watching, and we'll see you in the next one.